The first one was not planned. Before that, I had no intention of hurting anyone. I had fantasies of control and dominance, but not of murder. To me, murder started as a way to gain control of the situation. Not to get away with it, but to gain control over them. They could no longer speak to anyone. They could see no one else. I controlled their final moments, so I controlled everything about them. I did it to keep them with me. That's why I kept the skulls. The cannibalism, much like my other compulsions, began as mere curiosity. But like my other compulsions, it quickly became something I could not control. I would eat the heart, the arm muscle, as a way to make them feel like they were a part of me. The compulsions, the fantasies quickly became such that I had to see them through. I was going to do this until I was caught. I've known that since I was 15 or 16 years old. But what else could I do? It was the only way for me to get relief.